Hello musicians. This video is a tutorial on how to do the body percussion song electric beat. We did this in class and we watched a video on music play online with Christian Nihia. It looked like this. This is the page we went to. We are doing lesson four electric beat. We watched the video that looked like this. And if I skipped forward, we saw this person. Now, some, for some people, this went a little too fast. So I'm going to break it down a little bit more. And I'm going to show you some other resources on that page. So first of all, I like to stand up when I do body percussion. If that's not an option for you, or if you choose not to, that's OK. We can work with that as well. I'm going to stand up. And I start by saying the words electric beat, electric beat, electric beat, beat, beat. Electric beat, electric beat, electric beat, beat, beat. I say electric beat the third time, I say beat three times. With the body percussion, I start with hitting my thighs on electric. Beat is a clap. Electric beat, move to my upper body. Electric beat, electric beat, beat. The second half is almost exactly the same with one thing I can change. Electric beat, electric beat, electric beat, beat, beat. That is where you can make a choice. In our video that we watched, Christian Mejia did stomps at the end. The first time there were three beats, he did claps. The second time, the very end, he did stomps. I did tell you, you have the option to not stomp. For some of us, we might get in trouble for being too loud. You might have an injured leg or injured foot. It means you're hurt. I don't want you to hurt yourself for music class. That would not be fun. So if you can't, just do claps. Then your first half and your second half are exactly the same. I'm going to do it the whole way through. That's six electric beats you're counting. Three to start, then three more. Ready? OK. Electric beat. Electric Electric beat, electric beat, 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 electric beat, electric beat, electric beat, beat, beat. I'm trying to do stomp and clap. You can do that. You can choose one or the other. It's entirely up to you. That part doesn't bother me as much as if, as long as you are saying the words to hear the rhythm, getting the sounds right. I'm going to show you one other thing that you can see. So when we did the video, you might have noticed there was a drum beat. We clicked on videos to get to that video before. If I click here on MP3s, I'm going to make sure that you'll be able to hear what I play. There's electric beat slow. That sounds like this. If I click the back button, I'll do the full thing all together. The back button is also this one, which is the regular normal speed, normal tempo is the music word. I'll make sure you can still hear the sound, but I'm going to play that one and you'll see me full screen. If you want to say electric beat, electric beat, to help you get the rhythm, you can do that the whole time. Or you can do what I did there. I stopped saying the words, but I was thinking them in my head to help me get the rhythm, but I was letting my body make the noise. So it's up to you. I hope this tutorial video helped. You can also watch that video or this one as many times as you need just to practice and get it in your ear. This body percussion song is sort of our transition song. We started by doing sevens. We're just moving to the beat, but learning some patterns. This one, electric beat, has a little more complex rhythm.
and our next one will be even more complicated. So make sure that you're practicing each one so you can get different aspects of what we're doing in our bodies. Having a steady beat, learning how to use different parts of our body to make noise. Those are all skills we're going to use as we move forward learning more about body percussion. I'll see you all again in class really soon. All right, bye.